are going to discuss very interesting question for JEE. So, f of x equal to the maximum of this function is given. Which option is correct? You have to check it. First, these kind of question, what you can do? First, you have to find out where these two graphs are intersecting. So, 1 plus x is equal to 1 minus x. You can equate it first and second. Then, 1, 1 cancel 2x equal to 0, x equal to 0. Let's take the 1 plus x is equal to 2. You can <coughs> take it. So, x is equal to 1. And 1 minus x is equal to 2, you can take it x is equal to minus 1. So, therefore, the breaking point here is what? Minus 1, 0 and 1. You have to check whole real number less than minus 1, minus 1 to 0, 0 to 1, more than 1, you have to check it. Suppose if I take if x is less than minus 1, you can check it. The maximum of these three functions will be 1 minus x. So, how to verify this? Let us take minus 2 here. It is 3. Comparative 3 function. So, 1 minus x is the maximum. If x is minus 1 to z, 1, minus 1 to 1 you can take. Let us take minus 1 by 2 or plus 1 by 2. Any value you can take in this interval. So, the maximum will be 2 only. So, maximum of these 3 function it is 2. If I take x is greater than 1, let us take 2. So, which is the maximum here? 1 plus x is the maximum. Okay, 1 plus x. Then how to redefine the function f of x equal to? If x is less than minus 1, the graph is 1 minus x is the maximum of these three functions. If x is minus 1 to 1, so the maximum is 2. If x is greater than 1, the maximum here is 1 plus x. Okay. Then how to draw the graph of this? You can see here, this is your x-axis, this is y-axis, minus 1, 0 and 1. If minus x plus 1, it is negative slope is no, you shift 1 unit up. If you put minus 1, it will be 2. This is a graph, y is equal to minus x plus 1. And minus 1 to 1, it is 2, y is equal to 2, right? And then more than 1, y is equal to x plus 1. Just y is equal to x is there. No, you shift one unit up past your slope. Therefore, the function is continuous everywhere, but it is not differentiable at x equal to minus 1 and plus 1 because there is a sharp edge at minus 1 and plus 1. So, there is no unique tangents, right? Therefore, it is not differentiable at x equal to minus 1 and 1. So, which is the correct option? Differential with all points except x equal to 1 and minus 1 is the correct answer.